happening right now, an iconic Savannah landmark is getting a facelift. We want to get right out to our Nakaya Carrero, who is live this morning. And Nakaya, walk us through what's uh, set to happen there behind you. Emma, I'm standing here right in front of this iconic globe that sits on Duran Avenue right before Abercorn Street. It has been here in this same exact spot since the 1950s, but many wonder with all the construction going on in the area, what will happen to this globe? Well, Alderman, Savannah Alderman Nick Palumbo posted these pictures on Twitter yesterday saying they're now repainting it. He said they even brought in the same person who painted it back in 1999. And looking at it up close, you can see the painstaking detail, then the thought that they put into it to really bring it back to what it was, to keep that globe design uh, there, but give it a fresh coat of paint so it can give us many more years of great service. Now let's talk about the history of this globe. The Savannah Gas Company built it in the, 19, in the 1950s to store gas. That lasted until the 70s. We're told it was bil billionaire Ted Turner's father who pitched the idea to paint it like a globe. So in 1999, Eric Henn painted it and now we're told he's back to give it an update nearly 25 years later. Now, later this morning, Parker's gas station, who now owns this property that the Globe sits on, will hold a press conference to talk about the future of the Globe. Coming up in 30 minutes, we'll tell you what Savannah Mayor Van Johnson says he hopes happens with the Globe. Emma? Now, Nakaya, the artist who painted the Globe back in 1999, he painted something special right next to uh, Georgia and South Carolina. That's right, Emma. He painted Hurricane Floyd, which hit our area back in 1999, but he painted it spinning the wrong way. So he had to go back and repaint it so it was spinning in the correct direction. And a fun fact, Jonathan says that was the first thing he noticed when he moved to Savannah forever ago. So, all right, Arnakaya Carrero live for us this morning. Thank you so much, Nakaya.